Hey guys, welcome to another Happy Japan video. Today I'm going to show you how to make holes in your design in the iClick software. Uh, in this case, we're going to use the O in the O letter because uh, it's a perfect example for uh, me to show you guys how I want to do this. Uh, we're going to choose import. We're going to do this one. It's a, a logo from a college football team. And okay, we have it there. Put it in the center. It Let's make sure that you put it right in the center. And just make it a tad bit smaller. Oh, sorry. Yeah, that's it. So once we position it, we lock our design in here, which is lock and unlock background. We press it and we start using our tools. Uh, this is going to be a short video. I just want to show you guys how to actually do this. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make uh, the tummy around the O. We're going to make like a circle around the, the actual border of the design. So let's just make these. 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 Just you know, follow the path. Try the line to be as close as possible to the actual design. And we're good to go. Once we've done this, remember you can always modify any line that wasn't like really well stitched. You can just change this. Just make another line in here, make another line in here. Make another line in here, 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 and here. Right? Okay. Let's try to approach this a little bit. Of course, this process is going to take less if you do it. I just did it quick for, to show you guys what I actually want to show you, which the lesson of day day is about. Okay, let's just assume this is just done correctly on the first try, right? Let's just do this in quite big. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so we finished this up and we uh, just see our design in here. And then what we're going to do is selecting the actual object. We, we, we will, we're going to know that it's correctly selected because it's outlined. It has like a black border around it. Uh, we're going to press the outline option in our tatami menu. Make sure you have this activated. And what this does is that it's going to create a hole in the design that you want. So the way that we're going to do this is that we want to make um, like these little dots. We want to connect them all around the hole we want to make. So it's easier for us to actually separate it. So once we've done the figure and like 75% of it, again, we go to modify stitch. We can add this and we can just complement it. And And now we're done. And as you can see here, the actual design is, is done. We eliminate a lot of stitches. This has two main functions. Um, the most important one is saving you stitches. That means time, that means thread, and of course that means money for your business. So I just wanted to show you guys how to do this quickly. Of course, this will change depending on the complexity of the design, the number of holes you want to do, and if the actual uh, design you want to do. So then again, thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you and well, then again, thanks for watching.